Hello, I'm Nick with Sipe, and in this video, we're going to set up OneDrive on your Mac. In a previous video, we described OneDrive as a cloud storage service where you can store any file you want and easily share it later. To get OneDrive working on your Mac, open up the App Store. Its icon looks like a white letter A inside a blue circle. Then, in the upper right corner of the app, type OneDrive. Once you find the free OneDrive app, click the button that says Install. Once it's finished downloading, open OneDrive. You should see a window that reads, Set up OneDrive. Go ahead and enter your NKU email address. After a few more windows load, you'll be prompted for your password. The next step is to tell OneDrive where we want to keep the folder it's going to sync. Select Choose OneDrive Folder Location. Although you can put this folder anywhere, I recommend you use your home folder. Just select the house on the left with your username, and then click Choose This Location. Confirm your choice by clicking Next. OneDrive then gives you the option to decide what things in the folder we made will actually sync. You'll want to use the default All Files and Folders on my OneDrive option, so just click Next. Finally, OneDrive says it's ready. However, we have one last step to do. Directly above the big blue Open My OneDrive button is the text Open at Login so my files sync automatically. And next to that text is a box we can check. Make yourself a happy person and check the box. With that done, you can open your OneDrive. In the future, you can access your OneDrive by clicking the blue Finder face on your dock. One customization I make here is to add OneDrive to my Finder sidebar. All you need to do is click the little house that represents your home folder, then drag the OneDrive folder over to the left. And you're done. Don't forget to check out our other videos or contact us if you have questions or want help with your course. You can find us in Steely Library, email us at site at nku.edu, or call us. Our extensions are in the description below. Thanks for watching.